Hi, I'm Rosalind Tan and this is my co-host for today again, Cinnamon the Lion. Right now, we are going to do the review for Special ID. Special ID is the film that marks Donnie Yen's return to contemporary action movie after six years of absence from this genre. So is it worth watching, Cinnamon? Cinnamon tells me that it's just another movie that sells itself solely on Donnie Yen kicking ass on screen. Just as how we know Donnie Yen kick ass on screen. The fight scenes are what makes Special ID worth the price of admission. Fans of Donnie Yen will definitely appreciate his raw and brutal style in the martial arts. The cinematography by Peter Pao and action choreography by Donnie Yen combine to create a distinct theme for each fight scene which gives them the feeling and emphasis that are previously associated with Pujili's films and Wong Kar Wai's The Grand Master. With fantastic action choreography aside, director Clarence Fong often tries to write Chen into a quandary by forcing him into situations where his superiors and colleagues are questioning his capability of returning to being a cop as he has been undercover for so long. Except that Chen has never done anything truly despicable while he is undercover aside getting numerous tattoos and adapting a rough mannered way of speaking. The film also tried to show meaningful conversations that took place between Chen and his colleagues. But the supporting characters are so shallow that seriously if the people behind the editing work could edit them out and you know perhaps save for Chen's mother, it would still work, the film would still work, yeah. Overall, we don't think that this is the best film to highlight the return of Donnie Yen. The film tried too hard and I think it would have failed if they casted someone else other than Donnie Yen, honestly. Alright folks, that wraps up our review for Special ID. Don't forget to stay tuned to cinema.com.my